नमस्ते सर गुड इवनिंग नमस्ते हैप्पी टू बी विथ यू अगेन आफ्टर अ वेरी लॉन्ग टाइम एंड वी आर डूइंग दिस वीडियो टू अप्राइज पीपल अबाउट वॉट्स हैपनिंग इन द वर्ल्ड ऑफ सी वी हाइड्रो एंड द स्पेस ऑफ सॉइलिस फार्मिंग हाइड्रोपोनिक्स एंड मिशन हल्द्रक ऑफकोर्स सो इट वॉज अ ग्रेट लास्ट फ्यू डेज दैट वी वर बिजी विथ अलॉट ऑफ थिंग्स सो आई थॉट ऑफ चेकिंग विथ यू एंड would also request you to uh, share some happenings that people can expect in the near future uh, let's start with last year and uh, how last year went okay. so i think we started uh, a bit late last year doing our boot camps and on mission haldrak which includes turmeric and ginger as such mm-hmm. and uh, we did about 6 boot camps and trained about 210 plus i think people from various parts of india as far as uh, Uh, meghalaya and uh, as far as delhi noida all these kind of places and uh, it it was very interesting because we had people from all walks of life who had come to explore the science of soilless uh, horticulture especially within the realms of uh, hydropon i mean uh, turmeric and ginger so after each boot camp we had people showing interest some of them uh, kept joining our growers group and uh, this year i mean last year and last year was actually a turning point for for us because uh, uh, you know we found that the interest that has been generated last year onwards mm-hmm. in uh, soilless ginger and turmeric mm-hmm. has uh, literally the curve has just gone steep yeah so this year we have about 20 uh, 3 small format growers growing in 500 and 1000 and 5000 and 2500 square feet and uh, happy to announce that we got four uh, projects one is a 2 acre project another is a 1 uh, acre project in dharwar and the uh, there's another half acre project coming up at balaghat in madhya pradesh and there's one coming up in kakinada that's another half acre so we are quite gung ho about things and uh, we are really looking forward to another beautiful year that's going to happen uh, i must say also that two very important things that happened in last year was we also introduced a new uh, very new newly curated course for those who are very eager to learn turmeric and or ginger mm-hmm. in in a commercial farm so we uh, we introduced a 9 month program and the program just started on the 1st of may it is still open for people to join any time but uh, what happens is people willing to or wanting to learn uh, on a commercial farm so what happens is there are a lot of people who are willing to put money they have land and they have everything but still they would like to do a 9 month program work on a farm learn the nitty gritty of actual commercial farming they'll see the results for themselves so that's going to be a game changer because next year uh, since we have so many uh, commercial projects there's going to be a big change by the time we harvest in february uh, the other thing that i also curated not curated i came up with an idea uh, most often like everyone knows in agriculture the farmers always ask uh, who is going to buy my produce okay you'll make wild make world class turmeric i'll make world class ginger without heavy metals chemicals is that who will buy so as cv hydro we approached a lot of people who could be potential buyers but everyone backed out for because they said we don't know and they had their own skepticism about things so this year cv hydro has uh, taken it on upon the owners upon ourselves and we have announced a buyback scheme where we will buy back from soilless farmers who are growing turmeric in in powder form we will buy back per kilo at rupees 200 That's and good. and we are also looking at uh, export markets in as we speak the i mean as the time goes by and uh, till harvest in february next year we will be working on getting importers from uh, uk U- european union japan us and stuff and uh, we are we are quite uh, confident that we will get those importers in hand if we do get those importers in hand and they sign up mous with us or agreements with us Uh, the whole game will change because the farmer will be offered 300 rupees a kilo because we are exporting yeah so the the opportunity for farmers to make some real good money by selling some real good uh, world class turmeric is here and uh, a lot of things are happening and uh, we are very happy to announce that last year was simply very beautiful till the month of february when harvest happened this year um and uh, this this year 
we also uh, like last year we did only six programs we could only do six boot camps this year we will be doing 14 boot camps starting yeah. from the month of june july july, july. Uh, and it will be in it will be done at places where our small format growers and commercial growers are growing yeah so there will be one boot camp in kakinada there will be one boot um, uh, three boot camps in darwar commercial farm of one acre and we are going to have several other boot camps in different states. One will be in Orissa. Uh, sorry, did I say Orissa? You did. Yes, Orissa. One will be in Ranchi. And uh, we will also be doing in Dharwar, Bangalore. And uh, there is another place I am not able to recollect. Uh, Shimoga, not Shimoga. Udupi. Uh, Karwar, Karwar. And Udupi is also there. Uh, Udupi and Karwar, yeah, yeah. correct. So there is excitement. And we are preparing ourselves this year. We are trying to bring in lots of new changes. We are trying to give in various types of plants. We are trying to make people, uh, you know, uh, excited about the whole thing. So we are looking at something very interesting by February next year. Yeah. And uh, once we, uh, we have these uh, commercial and small time growers showing us great results, it's going to be real fun. And I'm telling you, uh, we have already, for that matter, uh, you know, matched up with all the objectives of the National Turmeric Board and all it needs is more and more growers to come in and there's huge amount of money to be made uh, for future growers uh, who are using soilless cultivation methodology as a way to grow world-class turmeric and ginger. So that's what I wanted to say about the last, uh, what has been happening and what is going to happen. So watch the space and uh, keep in touch with us. You can, if you're interested to know more, you can dial up Eight eight seven double nine eight double nine double nine. Uh, that's the name is Mr. Rajib, and he's our director of operations, and he's right here with me. So, guys, make use of this opportunity. Take part in the boot camps and learn nicely. Understand the whole science. After the boot camp, you can also uh, go in for uh, the uh, small format growers group if you like, or for the next year's nine month program. We got so many different curated pro uh, uh, training programs which fits your as per your convenience yeah. and your time. So we look forward to a beautiful season ahead. Almost all our small growers are also pretty much ready to start. We just sent all their uh, most of their uh, goods this week. Yeah. And uh, next week we'll be sending them a little more. That'll that'll be the final, the grow bags and the cocoa peat. And uh, we are just you know raring to go. So that's how things are and uh, Mission Haldrak is pretty much doing well and will do better and uh, we will see to it that we will achieve our aims. Like I say, I always say and quote Napoleon Bonaparte, he said, I only see my objective and uh, the objective should give way. As simple as that. So um, the obstacles should give way. So that's how it is. We're going to kick hard, kick some real ass and uh, take Mission Haldrak to greater heights. That's how it is going to be, Rajiv. Exciting, exciting times uh, <laughs> we are living in. I just wanted to uh, sir, bring your uh, attention back to this. The most exciting part of this upcoming journey huh. is what I feel is that uh, most of the participants who would like to be part of this journey, be part of this mission, they get a chance to visit uh, commercial farms. There are not just one, there are about two or three commercial farms that they can visit. Plus, they can go through a three-day workshop at the live commercial farm. So that's the most exciting part. Oh, yes. Yeah, in the last five years, yes. uh, I mean, there was a big gap of three years uh, wherein we had two commercial farms in the past, but now we have two or three commercial farms. Yes. And these participants have the chance to visit. There are many people that who talk to me that they would like to visit commercial farms. They would like to see the setup. So now this opportunity is open for all the participants, all the interested people. They can register for our uh, workshop programs. Yes. And they get a chance not only uh, of visiting the farm, but they can go through a uh, workshop where they educate themselves. They get to know the science behind the whole mm -hmm. thing and go through a complete practical exposure or demonstration rather and then they'll be able to decide if they should move forward with a commercial uh, project or if they should start a small format exactly so the roadmap is remains the same but uh, this year is going to be exciting because yeah. this time uh, there are three boot camps at darwar itself yeah and that's a commercial one acre farm yeah and then we have adi's farm in uh, kakinada yeah. there's a half acre farm so uh, we have placed these uh, 
these particular what you call boot camps in such a way that they will be happening little maybe third month or fourth month after first planting because uh, anyone wanting to see a commercial farm would like to see plants at this height by then yeah. and uh, all lush and green and uh, the proof of the pudding will be there once you come there the students come for a boot camp and we're doing it in the commercial ones yeah they'll or if for that matter even in small format growers uh, farms they'll see the root zone analysis which is our signature uh, thing that we do every boot camp yeah. because that is where the secret and all the whole mystery lies the grand finale magic the grand finale <laughs> magic the whatever you're going to make money out of is, is inside the grow bag yeah so that is shown and we have shown it hundreds of times now to so many people everyone has seen it many of them who saw it and believed it have joined and become commercial growers this year 23 of them chose a small format so it's just exciting rajiv i mean i've never been so excited in my life you know because especially we started this journey in 2020 march or april when i you know during covid yeah all the research that went into it a ability to increase the curcumin content yeah. ability to create uh, produce uh, turmeric uh, rhizomes without chemical pesticide residue mm. heavy metal uh, traces no bi- microbiological contamination 100% or near 100% saleable produce means yeah. there's no diseases yeah. and we're really proud of uh, our journey yep and uh, thank you to all who joined our mission since 2021 january thank you to all of yeah. them and uh, thank you to all those who have joined this year and thank you in advance for 10 times more number of small format growers next year yeah absolutely this is how we're going to grow and uh, we are very confident mission health haldrak is on its way uh, jaise hum log bolte hain haldi kranti zindabad mm-hmm. hmm? desh ki tarakki kaisa ho haldi kranti jaisa ho so jai hind and uh, any other questions if you have yeah i, I want to have a little more chat about uh, one more one more aspect that i noticed that in the last uh, couple of years we've had many buyers potential buyers in the market uh, like recently we got uh, two potential buyers who were interested to check our samples the samples of our growers okay so for this new season um, uh, i mean in my interactions i have requested them to wait till the next harvest which would be somewhere around feb 2026 or march 2026 and i have requested these buyers to send in uh, their expression of interest so that that can definitely motivate our existing growers who joined this season yes. and also the potential growers who would like to join this journey and uh, that should enable these growers to send them their samples to these potential buyers right so i wanted to through your uh, uh, through this chat uh, with you i wanted to appeal to all those potential buyers in the market if they would like to see our samples they can actually write to us with their expression of interest yeah. to uh, which will definitely be uh, shared with all the growers that we have for this season the commercial growers especially right and uh, i think i want to i want to hear your thoughts about this interaction that we've been having with these buyers who are interested yeah i mean uh, see end of the day like i said uh, last year i was trying to talk to a lot of potent potential buyers yeah. in india i mean not abroad to be honest and uh, while everybody gets excited about the buy- buying back from farmers and things like that uh, there is always this hesitation you know what if we sign the agreement and they can't give us the right product and this and that and blah 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 how how do we know what the future is going to look like so cv hydro has always been you know maverick as usual we said yaar if nobody is ready to sign even a mou or even give a letter of intent i said cv hydro will jump in and be the first buyer perfect so that is how i have offered 200 rupees per kilo and uh, you seen that excel sheet that uh, shows what kind of returns people can get yeah. it, it gives about 21% of roi 21% of roi yeah. and that also in less than 3 years yeah and if it is uh, if if god willing we are able to get a export uh, market or an importer from abroad then they get 300 rupees a kilo which straight away increases their earnings as well as reduces the roi time yeah so it's a good thing that's happening and recently we were also mentioned in one of the vloggers uh, covered a small 2 minute video and we got 2.6 million views yeah. and we've been flooded and swamped by cl- calls yeah. which we just can't take yeah. and then uh, this recently there's this uh, there's this channel called the better india uh, better india they covered us and they made an instagram reel that's already touched about 2.6 uh, 2.6 lakhs yeah. viewers yeah. and f- 
the good thing is because better india puts it all on linkedin and even professional channels social media yeah we can we been getting some very uh, very enriching good very high quality leads and inquiries yeah and that's how we got one from uh, uh, some company in bangalore yeah and we got another one from uk yeah and uh, we have asked them to send us letters of intent yeah. we've sent them all our previous uh, lab reports and stuff and they're so thrilled because they themselves have said that we are not able to get good stuff from india yeah or, that is true yeah so there you are i mean everything is done yeah the training is there the hand holding is there up to harvest the post market is there everything is there and why would somebody not take uh, you know make use of that opportunity is what i'm saying yeah yeah it's a i think it's a field of endless opportunity uh, yeah. mission haldra ke is uh, opening the it's a, it's a it's a it's a journey like no other and it's a it's an audacity of hope yeah it's an audacity of hope i mean we are just a small company with just two people just imagine me and i mean rajiv and i nothing else and uh, we have the audacity to take on the world and sell world class turmeric to people we have the ability to make world class turmeric and which no nation on earth can find fault with yeah we will also dictate the price for such kind of stuff right yes. because obviously when foreigners and importers are saying it's impossible to get good stuff mm -hmm. and if i give you good stuff i'll charge you what i want yeah we can definitely have some premium on yeah there. definitely you have a premium on it why not mm -hmm. and i'm sure they'll make money also from this not that they won't make money everybody will make money and the whole idea of uh, the, what we are doing is just that just trying to increase the farmers incomes everybody in the chain should enjoy yeah everyone should win yeah. so that's what we want and finally the consumer is a buyer the last consumer the end user end user is a buyer but he should also eat good turmeric yeah. not the ones you uh, you find in the market with lead chromate and all this nonsense mixed in it you know yep. and uh, people think because it's nice uh, deep orange that means it's the most beautiful turmeric in the world it contains lead chromate which makes it shine like that or makes it color like that mm -hmm. so let's uh, you know let's come down to mother earth and say that yes we are all ready we have been prepared preparing we are prepared we will take on uh, the world uh, with beautiful turmeric which uh, they have never seen before yeah so the, that's what i would like to say rajiv thank you sir with that i want to thank your uh, time for sharing all this uh, information with our audience and i hope uh, you guys found some value in this video if you like it please uh, share it with your friends and family and if you have any questions you know whom to contact the number cv sir mentioned uh, that's my number which 8879989999 thank you for watching sir thank you for your time again would you like to have a parting shot thank you guys for watching uh, share and subscribe our, uh, to our channel press the bell icon yeah. and all what you want to press <laughs> just uh, uh, share with everybody because this knowledge of uh, is is meant to be spread yeah. so that you can do us a favor by just spreading this uh, word everywhere and we look forward to as many people joining our boot camps and joining our 9 month training programs or for that matter simply just buying our training videos yep. if if nothing else but yep. do something get started don't waste time the best time to do uh, plant a uh, tree was 20 years ago and the best time the next best time is now yeah. so don't wait or oh, i'll do it tomorrow tomorrow never comes so yeah. thank you guys for watching i'll look forward to seeing you guys at my boot camps or wherever in india we have got 14 boot camps this year in 10 different locations is just going to be amazing so uh just reach out to rajiv you got his number and uh, let's start the race thank you namaste thank you sir jai hind